Hello. Since I'm still taking a little vacation from that television, I thought I would work on something else. Since a lot of people buy the, or I should say, since a lot of these sweet marker generators, either the B and K or uh, to a much lesser degree, the, the leader LSW333, um, come up for sale online or eBay or at flea markets and they almost never have the probes. And uh, anyway, I, the one I picked up was no different. I, you know, paid 40 bucks for it, so. Uh, anyway, so uh, Dennis had gone ahead and uh, posted the manual for this, and because they don't come with the probes, uh, I had gonna have to build my own so what I'm working on right here it, right now is the demodulator probe uh, and, which is also the, the, it's got a, the detector in it so I went ahead and just bought uh, I don't know what I did with the lid I bought one of the very small um, containers uh, project boxes from Radio Shack what I'm going to do is uh, take a 75 ohm BNC cable and lob that off and poke a hole in the side here and put that in and I went ahead and bought some larger color, well you know the gator clips with the, uh, these have 22 gauge wire instead of the itty bitty ones I'm normally using because they're cheap. Um, the ones with the, I don't know, it's like 26 gauge wire. But anyway, so funny thing is, and I forgot something, hold on. Alright, I'll probably edit that little piece of me missing out. So, they sell these bo bo small boxes at Radio Shack. They're like $3 or $3.50. The smallest board they sell is this one here. And it actually comes as two pieces. Uh, this is the one I was using to create the... N2 slash K3 vertical couplet for the Philco. Anyway, so funny thing is these do not fit. This is part of the problem with Radio Shack. They just kind of don't get it, even still. So anyway, these do not fit. And I even shaved some extra off. Be that as it may, I had to go down to <coughs> Fry's to see if Either they had some PC board. I was actually going to trim this and, and use it, but anyway. So I was down there. I picked up a couple of things, and um, including the uh, clip leads. Well, they had a four pack of these, whatever brand Daytac Proto board, and these are 1.35 by 1.73 inches. And, lo and behold, they fit, not only do they fit inside the Radio Shack uh, project box, but the holes line up, so I'm assuming these must be made to a standard. At any rate, I paid $4 for four of these, so... Alright, enough of that. So basically, this is not that complicated. It if you can see that here. So basically I just created the board. I've got two 100k resistors, a 1000 picofarad ceramic cap, 10k. I did order a 1, 1N60P for off of eBay. They sell these things so cheap. I kept running across ones that were like 50 for $5. Uh, but uh, I did manage to find some 
outfit that was selling them 99 cents, including free shipping, for 10. So anyway, so I grabbed the 160p and I went ahead and put it together. You want to see? Oops. So here's my negative going across and so on and so forth. I, I, I just thought maybe somebody might find this useful because like I said, I see these popped up on eBay all the time and I've only seen one that came with didn't even come with the demodulator uh, <clears throat> or the uh, other probe <laughs> that I've got to build anyway. But anyway, I did not see any of them come with that and one of them came with only three sets of, of wires for the bias and they wanted like two hundred dollars for it which I thought was kind of funny. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this together I went ahead and uh, marked it up here, so I'll do the black wire here, the white wire here, yellow wire, and then the input here. So I'll be back. Okay, well, here we go. It's all back together, or it's all together, I should say. The uh, direct connect would be these two. The detector would be these two. Of course, I have my BNC connector on this end, so. There you go. Thought maybe somebody would find that interesting. We'll go ahead. Uh, I guess we'll be testing that at some point. And I guess I'll go ahead and clean this off. And I don't know why I'm playing prices right there. <laughs> anyway, I'll go ahead and clean this off and grab that TV again. And I guess I'm going to shoot for. We're going to see if we can make that new tube uh, picture fit on that screen and center it. So thanks for watching.